everyone, I'm Sarah and this is Budget Sew, where we create stylish fashionable looks as inexpensively as possible. Today I'm going to show you my sewing and crafting book haul from bookoutlet.ca. Just a quick note before we get started, the top that I'm wearing was a quick and easy DIY where I added a decorative element to a t-shirt. The link to the video with that DIY is right here at the top of the screen. The first book that I bought was DIY Dog Lovers, 36 Possum Canine Crafts by Cat Roberts. The list price of this book was $22.95, but I paid $10.19. From a cute Pomeranian mug to a bone-shaped welcome mat, this companion to crafting for cat ladies features 36 charming projects for dog lovers and their four-legged friends. There are irresistibly adorable items to decorate your home, accessorize your outfits, entertain guests, and of course, pamper your pooch. And they're all easy to make thanks to plenty of step-by-step -step photos, templates, and beginner-friendly crafting instructions. Bring whimsy to your wardrobe with Dalmatian print trousers. Customize a leash and collar for your cherished pup. Design a Dashoon shopping bag create sweet potty favors, and so much more. There are so many great craft ideas in this book, but I really like the paw print elbow patches. These patches are a lighthearted and modern twist on a classic look. These pupper patches make me smile. I'm gonna try these on one of my worn out wool sweaters. Then there's Generation T. 108 Ways to Transform a T-Shirt by Megan Nicolay. The list price was $18.50, but I paid $2.71. This inspirational guide with DIY attitude has everything you need to know about the world's great T-Shirt. How to cut it, sew it, deconstruct it, reconstruct it, and best of all, transform it. This book features more than 100 projects, plus 200 variations, for customized tees, tank tops, tube tops, even handbags, a patchwork blanket, iPod cozies, leg warmers, and more. Not a DIY expert? Not to worry. More than one third of the projects are no sew, meaning anyone who can wield a pair of scissors can put a personal stamp on her wardrobe. But the sewing basics are here too. Backstitch and whip stitch, gather and ruche, applique and drawstrings. This book is great. I love that not only does this book show you how to transform your t-shirt, but it shows you how to make your t-shirt into something completely different, like a hat. Since I'm a big fan of hats, I'm going to try that hat crafts first. The fit to be tied hat is a cinch, in both senses of the word. All you need are scissors and a t-shirt, and since you'll be using only a sleeve of the t-shirt, you'll have plenty of fabric left over to make a skirt to match or use the other sleeve for a small change purse. The next book is Gradient Knits, 10 Lessons and Projects Using Ombre, Stranded, Colorwork, Slip Stitch, and Texture by Tannis Gray. The list price was $27.50, but I paid $1.49. It was a steal. Knit your way through every color of the rainbow. Add a whole new dimension to your knitting projects by utilizing gradient colors with the help from gradient knits. Go from light to dark, add two color contrasts, work with multiple colorways and more. Author Tannis Gray, knitting expert extraordinaire, shows you all the techniques you'll need to add gorgeous color gradients to a wide variety of projects. Dive right in and get to work with these eye-catching yarns and 10 unique lessons on topics such as cabling, lace knitting, alternating stripes, thrumming, stranded color work, polka dots, modular knitting, German short rows, and simple knit and purl combinations, all using gradient yarns. Expand your skill set with patterns for garments and accessories from top designers around the world. The perfect blend of beginners and advanced projects and a comprehensive technique section give knitters the ability to create stunning gradient knitted accessories for your home or yourself, including mittens, a cabled hat, a polka dot pillow, blanket, lace shawl, tea cozy, and more. 
I like the gradient block cowl. Worked in a squashy, chunky weight yarn. This cowl is ideal for warding off the winter chill while also providing a versatile accessory to your wardrobe. Started off with provisional cast on and finished off with Kitchener Stitch for a seamless look. This large cable pattern, worked in consistent solids against a gradient stockinette background, creates a highly contrasting texture. This project is worked back and forth on circular needles to accommodate the large number of stitches. Double moss stitch sections at length, allowing the wearer to sport it long for a modern look or wrapped around the neck twice for extra coziness. Then there's It Girl Crochet, 23 Must Have Accessories by Sharon Santana. The list price was $25.50, but I paid $10.87. Create chic crocheted accessories with a boutique exclusive look. A hot fashion trend, crochet has become increasingly popular on the runway. Acro Crochet is a must have, well curated collection of chic and wearable items you might find and happily pay for in trendy boutiques. The projects in the book are organized by three styles, Art Nouveau, Bohemian, and Mod, and include hats, bags, scarves, mittens and fingerless mitts, belts, shawlettes, socks, and other wardrobe essentials. The designs use basic crochet stitches as well as more unusual techniques, such as Tunisian crochet, tapestry crochet, beading, applique, and join-as-you-go motifs. Projects range in difficulty from advanced beginner to advanced intermediate. Along with detailed instructions, many of the projects include stitch diagrams, favorites among crocheters for clearly illustrating stitch patterns. You will not only want to make these projects, you will want to wear them and gift them. I love the gypsy slouch hat. This slouchy cap is the perfect accessory to any bohemian ensemble. Its lacy texture and subtle beading lend a feeling of luxury. The contrasting stripe looks almost like a beaded headband and is an easy introduction to adding beads to your crochet. Worked in a lightweight wool, silk, and bamboo yarn, this hat has beautiful drape. Next there's I Love My Dog Embroidery, 380 stitch motifs for dog moms and dads. Discover 380 adorable dog-themed stitch motifs along with step-by-step -step techniques, templates, and project ideas for capturing your favorite pooch. Created by embroidery artist Mikiko Art and six other amazing embroidery artists, this fanciful collection of stitch motifs celebrates all things canine with a wide variety of breeds represented. With this lovely embroidery guide, you can create all manner of pups in embroidery and cross-stitch, including dogs and costumes to celebrate holidays throughout the year, Halloween, Easter, and Christmas. Sporty pups skateboarding, parachuting, and ice skating, and dogs who are getting stuff done, like fetching the newspaper, carrying groceries, and holding a bone. Dogs doing what they do best, classic poses, postures, and tricks, including roll over, give me your paw, and the ever-popular Rub My Tummy. Pooch is described as people, the farmer, the artist, the businessman, and the sneaky but lovable mailman. Mutt stitched with unique accents such as borders, frames, and alphabets. You'll also find guidance on how to customize motifs to fit your favorite Fido, plus a gallery of project ideas for showcasing your stitches. Grab a needle and some floss and transform your home and wardrobe from drab to double dog fabulous. My favorite designs are number 27, the corgi, number 136, the puppy with the star catching net, and number 386, the happy baby pose. The next book is Melissa Liebman's Designer Crochet Accessories. Fresh new designs for hats, scarves, cowls, shawls, handbags, jewelry, and more. The cover price of this book was $28.99, but I paid $12.74. Accessorize your wardrobe with one-of-a-kind crochet pieces following these new patterns from knit designer Melissa Liepman. 
Sometimes all it takes is the right accessory to pull off a great look. And if that accessory happens to be handmade by you, all the better. In this book, popular author, designer, teacher, Melissa Leapman shows you how to make more than 25 fresh and beautiful crocheted accessories for women. From winter warmers like cozy hats and scarves that make a statement to all season wardrobe builders such as one of a kind jewelry, colorful handbags, and stunning shawls, this book has it all. The projects include something for crocheters of all levels, from beginners to intermediate and advanced knitters. Crafters of all skill levels will find a project to keep their fingers busy. Each project offers easy to follow instructions, such as diagrams using international symbols and a clear photo to illustrate the finished piece. The back of the book also includes helpful resources such as general crochet and finishing techniques. Crocheters, just think of all those lovely handmade accessories to keep or give as gifts. Unleash your inner accessory crocheter and let this book guide you along. I love the ooh la la beret. The winter weather begins with a six-sided snowflake motif. Stitch it, wear it, and show off your French fashionista side. The next book is Warm Days Cool Knits. Lighter Designs for Every Season by Karina Ferguson. The list price of this book was $27.99, but I paid $15.12. Wear any season and style with knitwear inspired by southern climates. Knitting is not just for cold and snowy climates. For anyone who has ever stopped to wonder what knitters in the south are wearing and knitting, for the changing seasons, Florida designer Karina Ferguson has set out to show us in warm days, cool nights, lighter designs for every season. In this gorgeous collection of knitted garments and accessories, up and coming designer Karina has designed knitwear pieces appropriate for each southern season. Cardigans and hoodies stand in for winter coats. Knitted tees and short sleeve cardigans are perfect for spring. Tanks and cropped cardies are comfortable on warm summer nights. Pullovers and shawls are just right for fall. Through her choice of lightweight yarns and bold colors, Karina has set these pieces apart from the crowd of everyday knitted garments and shown them off as a versatile knitted southern wardrobe. I like the Janetta Garter Cable Cardi. This sweater is just right when you need something to take the chill off on a spring evening. This simple construction and easy garter cable pattern make it an ideal set in sleeve project for beginners. Then I bought Vogue Knitting, the ultimate quick reference, completely revised and updated from the editors of Vogue magazine. The list price was $29.99, but I paid $8.23. Such a good price. Have you ever wished your copy of Vogue Knitting, the ultimate knitting book, were easier to take with you on errands, outings, and trips? Now it is! This reference is an abridged travel size edition that contains concise information and hundreds of step-by-step -step illustrations to answer your knitting questions. Designed for knitters of all skill levels, this essential guide covers virtually every topic and technique, including learning how to knit, color work, terms and abbreviations, buttonholes, hems and zippers, standard measurements for men, women, and children. It includes shawl and accessory constructions. Bonus features include a needle inventory, a measuring tool with a ruler, a stitch gauge, and a needle gauge. And they're right here. I bought this book because I want to learn to knit more. I've knit a few infinity scarves with garter stitch, but I wanted to learn to do more. There are so many beautiful knitting patterns that I've acquired, and I can't wait to make them up. The next book is Embroidery, a step-by-step -step guide to more than 200 stitches by Lucinda Ganderton. The cover, cover price of this book was $20.99, and I paid $10.87. Embroidery is the ultimate stitch dictionary and the ideal guide to embroidery, whatever your level of expertise. The perfect reference guide to needlework Embroidery is a comprehensive guide to inspire and inform sewers of all levels. 
find advice on which thread, needles, or fabrics work with which techniques, and take a look at an incredible 200 stitches with levels of difficulty, step-by-step -step instructions, and ideas on where and how to use them. This practical guide covers sewing tips for dressmakers, needlepoint, and embroidery stitches with detailed information simply presented in illustration-rich pages. With embroidery, it's easy to find which stitch is right for your next sewing project. I love DK books, and this book is no exception. This book contains all the stitches I want to learn, and even ones I've never seen before. It's fabulous! Then there's Sketch Your Style, a guided sketchbook for drawing your dream wardrobe by Robin Neald. The list price was $23.95, but I paid $13.33. A guided sketchbook with over 50 inspiring exercises and prompts to help you bring your fashion vision to life. Learn to draw croquis, figures, clothing, accessories, and more to create your own dream wardrobe. I like that there's tons of inspiration and plenty of room to sketch in this book. Next, there's Happy Mail. Keep in touch with cool and stylish handmade snail mail by Eunice and Sabrina Moyle. It's more than just letter writing, it's an art. Guided by the lettering artist behind that Hello Lucky letterpress greeting cards, you can learn the basics of creating hand letter designs and how to apply your hand lettering and skills to create beautiful cards, stationery, envelopes, and more. Inside are tons of ideas, including reasons to write a letter, how to write a letter, and tips for decorating your letters. Included are more than 25 perforated cards and stationery designs. Simply tear out the pages, decorate, and mail your masterpieces to family and friends. So you can see the letter paper here at the back. And then you've got different types of cards you can pull out and write. With clear, simple instructions, Happy Mail introduces a variety of lettering styles, including the basics of old brush calligraphy and the basics of writing and mailing letters the old-fashioned way. Once you learn and practice several different lettering styles, follow along with the easy step-by-step -step projects to create beautiful, personalized, and handwritten letters, cards, and envelopes to share with your loved ones. You can customize the designs in this book and get ideas for creating your own designs. From thank you cards to postcards to birthday cards to just because cards, Happy Mail helps you connect to others with easy, creative, cute, and happy mail to send. I still send birthday cards, thank you notes, and all sorts of cards through the mail, and I think this book will provide some new creative ideas for me to post. Then I bought Vintage Needlecraft, 50 projects in Victorian style, gorgeous period designs for classic cross stitch and elegant embroidery shown in step-by-step -step photographs and patterns by Dorothy Wood. A wealth of exquisite designs evoking the traditions of the Victorian period, ranging from the simplest ideas to those requiring a little more skill. There are projects to appeal to all ages and abilities including a cross-stitch needle case, an intricate fan quilt, an adorable patchwork box, an elegant bag, a festive Christmas tassel, a traditional photo mount, and a wonderful wedding album. The projects are illustrated with helpful stage-by-stage -stage pictures, equipment lists, and patterns. My favorite craft is the butterfly brooch. Typically Victorian, this butterfly would look most elegant on a simple black dress. It could be pinned to a belt or even used as a hair accessory for a special occasion. I was thinking of pinning one to my hat. I hope you enjoyed my sewing and crafting book haul from bookoutlet.ca. Please like and share this video with your friends and family. I love sharing my new, vintage, and out of print sewing patterns and my tips tricks, quick fixes, and even my mistakes when sewing along with you. I also love sharing my wonderful fabric finds that I thrifted from charity shops, as well as brand new fabric online and in store. 
If you'd like to see more from Budget Sew, please subscribe and press the bell so you receive a notification when I release a new video. If you'd like to stay up to date with Budget Sew, follow me on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook at Budget Sew. Thanks for watching! See you next time!